welcome back to my channel. <laughs> to my channel. To my video. Thank you for watching. Thank you for clicking. Thank you for subscribing. It means a lot. It's been a while since I actually sat and filmed something and it almost feels like it's been too long. So, um, today's video is, I don't know. My skin has been some shit lately and I'm not here for it. But I just, I wanted to do my makeup because it's been such a long time. I'm not feeling myself right now because I look dry. I never know what I want to do with these videos. I just kind of get on here and just do it. And you know, if it works, it works. And if it doesn't, well, we'll figure it out later on. So I'm going to go wash my face and then I'll be right back. <laughs> what it do? What it do? What it do, what it do, what it do. Ooh. I'm starting to feel like myself now that my brows are on. They look a little mean. But, um, I'm kind of used I'm not mad at them. They look pretty good to me. So, actually, all my brows, let me just go ahead and tell you guys what I have on my brows. I used the Sephora Retractable Brow Pencil in Chocolate Brow. I want to do a fun look because I always want to do a fun look. I want to do something, 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 something colorful. Oh, 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 oh. I forgot that I bought some stuff from ColourPop finally. I don't have anything really colorful or that's not true. I have a bunch of their um, liquid lipsticks, but I don't have any of their Super Shock shadows. Or I didn't. I bought some because they were at Ulta and I just couldn't help myself. And I think that's what we're going to do today. So the ones that I have, see I bought this Dream Fever set and it comes with the color Jinxie. That's an ultra glitter. Hello, goodbye. Um, elixir, just kind of like a mid-tone brown. And my personal favorite that I'm gonna try to work with today. I don't know, I don't have the slightest idea how these work, but this one is called No Promises. And honey, this is me, right her. This is what I'm gonna work with today. I don't know what else I'm gonna do, but we're I thought I was gonna do something colorful, but you know what, I'm not even gonna speak because this, I, I don't know. I also got, I got Cheap Date Ultra Glitter, and then I also got Bay. Pretty. It comes, it's looking very blue on camera, but in person, it's blue-purple. Like a bruise. I got these weeks ago. I'm really not entirely sure how to go about using these, especially the matte ones, because I have two of the matte ones. And this one that I'm working with in particular is matte, no promises. <sighs> I'm curious to see how this is going to work on the eyes because I've never used them. And I really don't know what to expect. So, but they're fucking beautiful. Oh my God, they're gorgeous. I do know that I'm going to put down, I already have a base on as far as um, shadow bases. I have on my Milani Shadow Eyes Stick Cream Shadow Stick in Almond Cream. It's the best, my personal favorite as far as my primers go. I don't know what to do. I do. I lied. Alright, so here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna start off by using the Saharan by Juvie's Place palette. And I'm gonna start with Katsina. Katsina. That's one there. I don't know, it's kind of like a khaki color. Like it's a khaki color. <laughs> it's not too warm and it's not cool either. It's very neutral. And we're gonna use that as a transition shade. You guys know I like to do one eye first. One eye on camera and then the other eye off camera. It's just a lot easier to do. I'm very nervous about these Super Shock shadows because I've never used them. And I really don't know what to expect. I've seen a lot of people use the glittery ones, but I haven't seen that many people experiment. I'm gonna zoom in. I haven't seen that many people experiment with the matte ones. So at least I have, maybe I just wasn't paying that much attention to it, but I'm kind of nervous, guys. I'm gonna take the eyeshadow Jamila, that color right there. 
Very nice, very nice. And we're gonna take that and build it up a little bit more because it's not giving me what I want. I'm gonna start this at the outer portion and work our way in, guys. Work your way in. Are we tired of like warm looks? I'm personally not like I'm not over it yet. I haven't done my makeup in so long. Like I really miss doing my makeup. So I am gonna just go ahead and um, just just jump straight into it because I'm really excited about this and I really hope that it works the way that I'm expecting it to. So this is No Promises. I'm gonna try to apply it with a brush and then see what happens. So this is just a, I don't know. I, I, I'm pretty sure I got this from Target or maybe I got this from TJ Maxx, don't know. Either Target or TJ Maxx. I'm gonna take it and pack it on the brush. Ooh, it just fell. Okay, so I think my finger is gonna work better with this. It does. Absolutely 100% better. I'm going to attempt to blend it out. And to do so, I'm going to take, I'm going to take Butter Cake from the ColourPop Cute AF palette. I'm going to take this Morphe M514 brush and blend out No Promises. But it is blending. It's blending very nice. Is this like, is this spring or is this fall? Because the bitch don't know. Like, I'm going to pop some of these beautiful glitters on top of this. I just, I, I don't know which one yet. Uh, I mean, I could go... You know, real warm. I could go a little lighter, you know. We're about to finish. We're gonna find out eventually. Um, I feel like I wanna put like a gloss on top of it. Like that'd look real cute and like editorial. I'm gonna take some of this color here. It's called Mischief. It's one of my favorites from this palette. We're gonna excuse me, I just ate a salad, it was great. <laughs> <laughs> my lips feel so dry. Oh my god. Are we liking it so far? I mean, it looks messy. Fade away when it's just me and you. And it's more than a crush. And impossible. I don't care what they say when you're there. You know what, I will say that, um, do you guys remember Bratz, like the video game? That was one of my favorite games as a kid, and the music in that game, it's like still like replaying in my head, like I remember most of them word for word. It's crazy, like, crazy, I was just singing it, that's what I was singing. I mean, I'm not a singer, I don't sound good, but you know. What were some of you guys' favorite music growing up? I remember listening to a lot of Jojo. My mom listened to a lot of Tony Braxton. I listen to a lot of her now. I love Mariah Carey. Beyonce is, I am Beyonce. Like, she is me. That's all I have to say on that. Don't ever disrespect her. I'm gonna take a little bit of this black from the Juvia's Place palette. It's called Chad. And you know, I can't seem to do a look without black. And it's just for depth, you know. You know what, I think I'm going to keep it matte for some pictures and then I'm going to add some glitter on top because I just, I'm a shimmery loving type of bitch, you know, and I love me some glitter and some shimmer. I'm going to challenge myself to keep this matte. I'm going to keep the video matte and I'm going to have some pictures with some glitter and stuff on my Instagram. So go check my Instagram out if you want to see this look with some glitter. But don't worry because I'm going to go and finish the other eye and I'll be right back with my face off. <clears throat> they just make so much goddamn noise. Wow, that's crazy. So the face is just about done. I have my foundation on, contour and blush, highlight, all that. I'm sorry, concealer, not highlight. They're different. That's all on the other eyes finish. I am just about done with this look. I like to save the highlight for very last. <coughs> Excuse 
excuse me, I was eating my salad as I was doing my face. So let me give you the rundown of what's on my face currently. I've been using, I have been loving this. If you haven't seen my review on the, <laughs> my shrunk review on the Maybelline Superstay Foundation, definitely go check that out somewhere around here. I've been enjoying this foundation ever since I've used it and I actually haven't been reaching for my beloved NARS. I use the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Concealer in, can <laughs> in caramel and golden because I like both. I use Max Patrick powder to set everything and I use my Black Radiance powders as a kind of dusting off and contour. So I use golden cashews as like all over my face and then espresso, ebony as my contour. Um, we're gonna go ahead and finish off the eyes and now I'm gonna leave that um, inner corner blank because I'm gonna definitely put down some shimmer. I'm sorry guys, I know I said I was gonna try to keep this matte but as I stated before, I'm just a shimmery loving ass bitch, okay? I love me some glitters, I love me some shimmers. I need, I need a little something, a little, a little something. I don't have to be that much. It's not gonna take over the whole look. Just a little something extra, you know? Just a little extra. Hey, Carl. I'm so mad at it. I ain't mad at it. <laughs> I'm really liking it because it, I haven't done makeup in so long and I low-key miss it. I'm gonna take a little bit of Mischief from the um, ColourPop Cute AF and I think I'm gonna go with this one. I think I'm gonna go with Cheap Date, which you guys saw. Okay, and now I'm gonna add some lashes. What lashes am I gonna do? I'm gonna do ones that I haven't done in a long as motherfucking time, bitch. Oh, motherfucking yes, bitch. I can tie my hearted lashes. The lashes are on. I'm feeling way more me. <laughs> oh, car. Whew, I, I gotta stop with that. Man, do I really like this. Well, ColourPop, you really did it. I'm really, I'm really here for this. But I'm not done. I'm almost done. I'm gonna go ahead and add some highlight. I'm gonna, of course, use my baby Sephora Golden Hour. I love this. Shit. I have a lot of texture happening because I've been breaking out. But we're not, we're not even gonna focus on that. <laughs> it's a non-factor. And now I'm gonna add a lip. I'm sorry, I'm going with a nude. I hope that doesn't bother you. I'm gonna take my K lip liner from ColourPop. This, I feel like this has turned into a ColourPop. Yeah, I don't know how, but yeah, this needs to be sharpened. I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna use the NYX Strictly Vinyl Lip Gloss in Sugar Mama. Sugar Mama, 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 Sugar Mama. Oh, I'm officially feeling my motherfucking self. Oh, oh my god. Oh my. I'm in love. I'm in love with this. I'm in love with the whole look. I wish that it wasn't Tuesday. I wish that I was going somewhere looking like this, but I'm not. And that's the thing is, is I'm not going anywhere. That's why I didn't slay my edges. They're a little dusty from all the makeup, but that's okay. That's okay. I'm really liking this. Uh, I'm really fucking loving it. <laughs> I haven't done my makeup in so long now. I feel like myself again. I feel so happy. <laughs> and now that I have my face on a bitch is feeling lit. This twist out is bomb. This makeup is bomb. Today is just a bomb ass fucking day, even though it's fucking snowing. That's okay. That's going to be it for this look, you guys, for this video. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you liked it. I hope that you subscribe to my channel because there'll be more of these. I really like doing tutorials. I really like doing new makeup looks. This probably isn't new or innovative or anything, but it's cute and I enjoy doing it. I hope you guys liked it. If you liked it, then go ahead and like it. <laughs> um, share the video, like the video the video like the video and subscribe to my channel and follow me on my instagram it is the same as my youtube stuff e makeup that's going to be it i will see you guys on the next go round